Alright, so I'm here with a humble hustler in Thailand. What up, guys? Miguel Marquez. He is one of the most remarkable people I've ever met. Thank you, man. He's uh, 35 years old and he's very well achieved. Um, owner of his own clothing line, the Humble Hustler Pro. Check him out on Instagram at Humble Hustler. So, Humble underscore Hustler underscore Apparel. There we go. Don't forget that apparel part, guys. Um, I'm just actually talking to him about the whole business and everything else and how did he actually come up to be where he's at. And it's very interesting to me because I I wanted to get an idea of uh, of how did he actually come all the way. By the way, he's from Spain, guys. So And he knows four languages and is quite freaking fluent in all of them. So it's, again, this is remarkable for me. And, and he, he's kind of like, Kind of like a stunned by by my fascination about him, but he doesn't even realize that <laughs> he is quite remarkable. Anyway, the point is um, that I want you guys to get an idea of how he actually came about, and uh, and when I wanted to ask you for everybody else watching, of course, how did you came about? What what drove you to just come to Thailand and just build your own? Business and every an empire, yeah, it's an empire. <laughs> so basically, I was working in a corporate uh, company yeah, back in Switzerland, in Europe, and um, I had everything. I was happy, but um, I was happy, but I wasn't really happy. I wanted something else, something different, and uh, it was all about freedom. So I knew Thailand because I came here on holidays a couple of times, and to me, Thailand was the definition of freedom. Because basically you can do whatever you want here, uh, everything's possible. Um, so just one day I decided to take a leap of faith, uh, left everything in Europe and just came here, um, started hustling and uh, founded my first company, then get into another business and from, from there just kept on building uh, things. Now I know this is not just Humble Hustler, you are also part of uh, Nutrition Depot, is that correct? That's right. Now Nutrition Depot, talk to me about that a little bit. So Nutrition Depot basically we are the biggest uh, distributor in Asia for sports supplements. Uh, we started this in uh, Thailand four years ago. So I'm a shareholder, I'm the manager here in Thailand, so I manage the whole country. Uh, I help start it. Um, Vietnam, Indonesia, Malaysia. Um, I help. Uh, I'm doing currently Myanmar and Laos as well. So what I do basically is I help start those countries, and then we find a country partner. We put the country partner. Basically, the country partner runs the country. So what I'm doing basically is I'm handling Thailand and help other country partners as well. Uh, we bring uh, the most popular uh, sports supplements brands in the U.S here in Thailand and uh, yeah that's that's pretty much what I do in a, in a few words <laughs> understood like I'm like I said guys this comes from you know I mean, to me I, I find it fascinating because I, I came from nothing of course uh, I, I don't know a lot of things of course and you know being around not only positive people but people that have gotten their shit together you know <laughs> In a very short period of time, because I know that you, when you hear it's not that long since you've been in Asia, am I right? Eight, eight years. Eight years. So that's really not that much. I mean, I know people still in college for eight years that have done absolutely nothing with their life. And that's another point. To me, college was not an option. I didn't learn that much. Uh, I didn't understand the concept of just reading a book um, and paying to read a book. And I wanted to ask you too, did you get any education um, in a college or university or anything? No, not really. To be honest with you, where I learned a lot was uh, I was working for Procter & Gamble back in Switzerland. Uh, it's uh, an American multinational and uh, that's where I started learning a lot about business. And it's not about... How can I do... Uh, how can I say that? It's basically you learn by doing. You need to do things. You need to take action. So more, more hands-on, you think? More hands-on, sure. and it's all about taking action. I always tell people, just take action. Stop thinking. Stop thinking about what you want to do, about what you want to achieve. Just start doing, 
and as you progress you readjust things because you're never gonna get everything perfect never, it's never gonna be the perfect moment trust me there is there will always be something so just start and readjust things as you go oh yeah well there you guys have it for more please follow the humble hustler at Humble hustle, humble underscore hustler underscore yeah. apparel. Well, but follow <laughs> follow me on IG. Uh, follow me on IG. It's at mig m m i g m, and uh, from there you can just send me a DM. I love to hear from everybody, so just send me a DM, and uh, I can hook you up with uh, some apparels, whatever. Give you business tips. Uh, send you some. Uh, crazy positivity, and that's it. <laughs> well, there you go, guys. Stay tuned for more.